hello everyone welcome back to my channel i'm here to do a more video this is demon slayer 33 okay so i'm doing more horoscopes okay this is titled your horoscope for the new moon in taurus it could be all so simple new moons are a time for rejuvenation and manifestations and if you have a lack in your life then this is a good time to feel it through a new experience personal item we must make space for beginnings and foolish behavior during new moons. Mind you, we are all fools when beginning something new, so don't be scared to get experimental. For newbies, a new moon is when the moon and the sun meet at the same degree, forming what astrologers call a conjunction. As an astrologer, as a strategy practitioner, I'm all about precision because cutting through diamonds is possible. New moons are for setting intentions and goals to manifest. Take the theme of each new moon as inspiration to bring forth the best version of yourself. Yes, life will be life life will all be so simple if we all share the same brain cell. Okay I'm saying. Being on one accord like Beyonce and her dancers will be ideal. However, there's only one queen bee and that's okay. We all benefit from mistakes, failures, setbacks, disappointments, and boundaries. They are necessary teachers. On May the 19th at 11.42 a.m. Eastern Time, a new moon in Taurus will appear in the sky. It's joining so some portent astrology. On May the 16th, Jupiter entered Taurus' strong will in earthly domain. domain. For the past year, Jupiter was in the head strong and risk-taking sign of Aries. With the new moon joining Jupiter and Taurus, you are feeling outspoken appreciation for sensual desires. Spiritually likely believe that this new moon will bring forth gifts that can teach you new methods of understanding and meeting your basic needs. This new moon is, re is rendered visibly in the sky on May the 19th, 2023 at 11.52 a.m. occurring at 28 degrees. This new moon is purely for so 10. The, this new moon is purely for kicking back and relaxing, which, mind you, will be a challenge for some of you. When your body is loose to being in go mode, then being still will feel unfamiliar. Embrace what's good for you, babies. Read your horoscope based on your sun, moon, and rising sign. Read for your sun sign to gain insight based on the version of yourself that you are maturing into. Your rising sign to reflect on your present state and your moon sign for guidance on how to nurture your inner child, okay? Your horse goes for the new moon in Taurus. So if y'all had Aries anyway in y'all short, it could be for you. Money, guac, dinero, cash flow, abundance, values, yen. That's it, Hattie. That's your horoscope. Focus on appreciating your inherent abundance. Your wealth comes from the most basic of places. You, your birthright is to live in a limitless state. Within your lifetime, you will spend millions. When you find your motivation, push your mind and drive and head to your destination, okay? And this is for you, Taurus. This so y'all have this anyway in y'all shorts. This new moon will put money where your mouth is. Open up, treaty, but no money tastes gross. So take that metaphor for what it is. Money represents your ability to appreciate and be appreciated. And your mouth is how you express and receive gratitude. Remember, your self-worth defines your value. Okay? If y'all have Gemini's anyway and y'all short, it could be for you. During this new moon, you have a lot of blessings to keep in your mind. Keep the lines of communication between your soul and soma, aka body, open. If you feel in tightness, soreness, or tension, preach yourself. And by preach yourself, I mean get the care you need. The better you care for yourself, the more you can do for your universe. Okay? I hope it's for my day. Okay? If y'all have cancers anywhere in y'all short, this for you. It could be for you, Cancer So I hope it's for baby. Have you kept your wishes and goals in mind? Hopefully you hold your wishes close to heart because astrologically speaking, now is a predictable time for them to actualize. You have to be the driving force in bringing your desires to life. This new moon will be a catalyst if you embrace it. However, magic is simply potential without actions. Okay? If y'all have Leos anywhere in y'all short, this could be for you. I'm a Leo. This could be for me. For you, this new moon represents a breakthrough. 
Amen. I hope so. Hallelujah. I recommend communicating with the universe and showing that you're ready to reach the next level. The world can appreciate an underdog. So if you felt like giving in, this is the time for you to keep on pushing. Let yourself be surprised by absolutely unpredicted outcomes. Now is the time to welcome the unimaginable. Okay. Okay. This for you, Virgos. If y'all have this anywhere in y'all show, I hope this for you, Mike. Rest assured that you are you are in an endless well of knowledge. Your abundance when seeing what you know. Your work radiates in the eye of people who have witnessed your demonstration of self-expression. Trust and believe that whether your community is speaking life into you, that they are paying homage to your essence. Okay? This is for you, Libra. So y'all have this anyway, y'all sure it could be for you. I have this for my son, young boy. He is a Libra. All good changes come through in come through innings. Some of you might feel a sense of relief when you welcome conclusions. There's a certain peace that cloaks the body when ending a chapter. Let yourself enjoy it as it drapes over you. There may be disappointments that come with innings and it's a, and it's valid to more bittersweet feelings, okay? This is for you, Scorpio. See, I have this anywhere in y'all short could be for you. So I hope it's for Ken again. You getting the happy ever after that you deserve. You know you might not see it coming. It can appear within your close friendships, potentially developing an evil deeper bond to a friend than you expected. For those of you who are interested in love and romance, the nose are pointing you towards receiving what you need. Um, she listened to my baby. I did listen to him though. I ain't gonna lie. I listened to my baby. That's just, just a little bit of time yet. Okay? This is for you, Sagittarius. This is for y'all. You have Sagittarius anyway, your short could be for you. I did for my baby again, Kia. Darling, focus on your health and maintain your motivation to upkeep your self care. We will. You need no elbow plans or in, in effective diets. Sometimes the best care you can give yourself a full body of substance. Accepting yourself wholeheartedly is a great first step towards becoming your best self. This new moon is a great time to appreciate yourself, heart, lungs, and all. Okay? If y'all have Capricorns anywhere in y'all short, it could be for you. I hope it's for my grandpa. Capricorn, this is a perfect time to say yes to a weekend date. Oh, really? Yeah, okay. If you single, there may be someone who stands out to you more than usual. Take a chance and say hello. You never know just how great interacting with them may be. Go in with no expectation. Thanks, thanks Grandpa. And enjoy how the future unfolds. If y'all have Aquarius anywhere and y'all short, it could be for you. Oh, this for, um... Let me tell you again. A personal and longer rated transformation is occurring, Aquarius. After years of active reflection, observation, and introspection, you are capable of identifying the right environment for you. Similar to plants, you are intended to grow in the right setting. Create a space that motivates you and watch as you just for life increases. Okay? This is for you, Pisces. If y'all have this anywhere and y'all short, it could be for you. I heard it for. Kodak and for me and, and my best friend, my other best friend, Pisces. Okay, take your time finding all the white words and vocalizing them authentically. Authentically, this is a period for you to do the work on yourself in order to appreciate yourself deeply. There's no shame in taking space if you need it or disappointing people. In this life, you are capable of choosing you, so you might as well make yourself a top priority. Okay, also, I hope y'all enjoy my peace.